What's up guys, my name's Dominic and as always, welcome to the Reviewer Executioner Corner. Today's review is on a shooting stand. So basically, it's just like a stand that you can put like, you know, target papers on. So, um, two things that we have here. This is the box itself with the um, metal stand itself, I believe. And then uh, 45 rolls of uh, shooting target paper, which is nice that they give you that too. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna open up, take a look at how it's installed and actually give it a shot and see how it actually performs too. Um, since I do have a gun range in my backyard. So uh, let's get to it. All right, so we have now both of the items in front of us. This is really what you should be expecting um, in the mail. Um, but we're gonna open up both. Um, this seems to be the parts, like we said. This is 45 rolls of target paper, but there are parts in here. I don't know if you can hear that, but I definitely hear something's going on. So let's take a look here. All right, so we got that open. We'll just dump everything out there. Is there anything else inside here? Nope. Okay. All right. So I don't see really any instructions or anything like that, but I'm just going to start pulling this out. It all wants to come out. Now right, we got that. Still struggling to get all this out. Got that. Probably better if they wrap this individually a little bit. But we're almost there. Just ripping the packaging. There we go. All right. So um, pretty straightforward. This seems to be like the thing that would go in the ground. Um, and then you just kind of just start twisting the poles um, all together. So uh, pretty straightforward there. I'm going to take a little bit closer look at everything too before we put that together. And then we're just going to open uh, this up too. All right. All right, so. Oh, there's another piece of tape sitting there. I don't want to cut this too bad. This kind of sucks, this knife. Whatever. that off um, so. okay so a bunch of uh, things just fell out of it just went flying off the camera so um, just to give you guys an idea it was these little uh, clip things so these little clippy things are in there and just take a look at the target it's like an old-fashioned brown looking target um, so we'll set one of these up and uh, see how it goes so um, I'm going to start putting this together and give you guys a better idea how that works out and then we'll start uh, doing the performance and uh, everything. Alright guys, so I pretty much have it laid out on how you should have it set up. Um, I thought this was the easiest way to actually do this video because um, there was no instructions with the um, box itself. So I kind of had a guess at this. Uh, thankfully I had an image to kind of go by. So. Um, you know, if you guys are lost on how to set this up either, um, hopefully this video helps you. It's pretty easy. Um, it can get a little confusing depending on where you put the part, but, um, realistically this should take you five minutes to put together. All right. So the first part, um, is going to be the bottom portion. So that's going to be your, um, stabby portion that goes in the ground. Um, next you want to have, um, one of these little long neck portions. Um, that's going to meet here and you're going to push that in and let them overlap and then screw them in. Now there's another portion here. This will be separate. This will not be on this pole. So you can slide this right out. Um, and these won't be in here either. These little long rods. So these little long rods, um, actually screw into the sides here and you do want them to face downward. Um, but you want to put this on here because what this is going to act as is basically um, where the poster is going to meet. You're going to have to adjust it to the poster's level. I kind of like that too because if you run out of these and you get other target pieces of paper um, and they're different sizes, at least you can adjust it to the size of it. It doesn't have to be just 
um, these exact target papers. So uh, kind of actually happy by that. So um, once you have that done, you're going to then link up the next one and then you're gonna tighten that down. And then all the way at the tippity top, um, you're gonna have this kind of like, you can see it's like a ball looking portion. That's gonna be like the head. It's gonna sit on there and it's gonna be the same thing for these little long portions. So you're gonna screw in these little portions, have them go down, and then you can see pretty much what the job does. You just kind of put the clips on there. So I'm going to uh, just set up really quickly and just give you guys a idea what it looks like once it's really put together. All right, guys, so we are in the little gun range that I have here in the backyard. Um, don't mind all this stuff. Um, this is just my other little target um, posts that I put papers on and shoot. Um, I'm probably gonna move these guys um, to the sides and move this one to the side too and then put that guy up on the hill one day. Um, just because it's kind of low to the ground, I do gotta fix that corner in a second. But uh, I'm gonna use my AK. Um, I'm gonna shoot a couple of rounds and just see how uh, how it uh, you know it lasts. Um, again, it's just a simple metal pole. My only scarcity is probably like if um, by accident maybe I hit this, I could see me snapping it or breaking it immediately. But um, you know, obviously I'm gonna try and aim for the targets. But uh, I'm gonna fix that and then I'm gonna set up the video to take some shots and then we'll see how it, uh, you know, um, would stand the shots. All right, guys, I got my, uh, my AK-47. I'm just gonna take some random shots at it and see how it goes. All right, so I do see some hits so i see some uh different target hits um yep see one over there now when i did see now like i said guys i could see if you had you know maybe a little bit of a stronger round um it could probably break this um i could see here's the shot right here and it nicked it but you know if i directly hit it it could probably snap it right in half so do be cautious about that but um this is the easy u uh door um shooting stand i hope this video gave you guys an idea of what to expect in the package out of the package assembly and um you know just some practice shooting on it too so uh guys i uh, hope you guys have a great day if you want the product it's in my description the link below please subscribe that does help too and uh, have a great day